Alright, so in this problem we want to isolate the variable d from our formula, and before we do so we are going to rewrite our formula p equals f times d all over t. Now in order to isolate this d, we want to get rid of this f and t, and in order to do so we can multiply on both sides the reciprocal of f over t, and the reciprocal will be t over f. And if we multiply it on both sides, then it's going to look like this. The f's are going to cancel out on, and the t's are going to cancel out on the right hand side. And on the left hand side, we have t times p, which is p times t, or the other way around, all over f. And now on the right hand side, we are only left with d. So this is going to be the definition and the isolated version of d. And if we take a look at our answers, d represents our answer perfectly and therefore will be the right answer.